The DeLorean is back with an 88-unit Alpha 5 EV concept. People who couldn't tell a Corvette from a Civic can typically immediately spot a DeLorean. Workers in Northern Ireland produced just short of 9,000 of the V6-powered stainless steel shelled rear-engine coupes from 1980 to 1982 before DeLorean Motor Company, or DMC, collapsed under debt and alleged drug dealing by its desperate namesake John DeLorean, who was found not guilty of the charges against him in 1984. But by then, DeLorean was done. Not many cars have the emotional pull of a DeLorean, the future is so bright 1980s automotive icon that was cemented into pop culture like few other cars after a star turn as a rolling time machine in the 1985 mega-hit movie Back to the Future, and the sudden and swift demise of the company and the man who created it. Now, 40 years on, it appears to be back. John DeLorean passed away in 2005 at the age of 80, but 10 years before his death, the remains of the company were bought up by an Irishman who had grand designs on resurrecting the cars in their original form, but it was not to be. Now, the brand has moved to the U.S. under the supervision of Jos de Vries, formerly of Tesla and Fisker Karma, and he's got plans not just to revive the hallowed name and the signature car, but to expand and grow DeLorean into a contender in both the EV and gas-powered market segments. First up will be the new DeLorean, known as the Alpha 5, which will be a limited production, high-performance, all-electric four-seat sports coupe, much like the original, save the electric part. The car was recently announced and renders revealed. DeLorean says a physical specimen will debut in August at Pebble Beach, with production slated for 2024. DeVries told Autocar that he hopes to take DeLorean public at about the same time the first car gets shown later this year. Only 88 initial EV units are planned. You likely know why that number is key if you saw the movie. In Back to the Future, the flux capacitor-powered DeLorean has to hit 88 miles per hour before it can launch into time travel mode. The new DeLorean EV is designed by Giorgetto Giugiaro, who also came up with the original DMC-12, as the 1980s car was officially known. Giugiaro is now the head of design firm Ital Design. The EVs will be built in Italy, according to CEO De Vries, with some powertrain input from companies in the UK. Oddly, the first 88 cars will be tied to NFTs in some form, and will not be street legal, despite performance numbers that will include a 150 mile per hour top speed, 0 to 60 in under 3.5 seconds, and over 300 miles of range from a 100 kilowatt battery pack. Cars built after the initial 88 units will be street legal. If funding and construction plans reach fruition, the EV will be followed by several other DeLorean models, including a V8-powered sports car and a hydrogen-powered SUV, among others. But for now, the upcoming DeLorean EV is looking to the future while paying homage to the past. Gullwing doors, rear louvers, and the iconic metallic finish. There's no word yet on if it will include a flux capacitor.